Hello, uh, this video is going to be on uh, the login manager, uh, Light DM login manager, and uh, a workaround if you want to use the, use the uh, elementary OS greeter, GTK greeter. Uh, the background doesn't seem to work no matter what you try, but there is something that seems to work, and I'll try to demonstrate this in uh, VirtualBox. So I'll just log in, and you'll see. Uh, Desktop similar to mine because that's what it is. <laughs> and I'll resize this. Hopefully. There we go. Okay. So I've already installed uh, Light DM, uh, the GTK greeters and stuff. So it resides in Etsy Light DM. All right. And uh, here, that's the name I couldn't remember the Light DM Pantheon greeter configuration file. And there's two we have to edit. If you don't want to open this as, as a root uh, user, you can open the terminal and do like a sudo leafpad light dm.conf. And we'll go down to not that, the word has a seat colon asterisk. And it shows a uh, reader dash session. It's commented out by the number sign, pound sign, hash sign, whatever you want to call it. So I'm going to take that. Um, uncomment that and the session is called this so I'll just go to properties and just copy this first part control C or just copy I'll close this and we'll go back to our light DM and paste the name of that in save and quit and I'll close this and quit so um So we'll restart. I don't know what's going on here. Uh, restart the system in VirtualBox. Okay, it's acting a little weird because of VirtualBox. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, so I'll just log back in as my user. And it does work. Okay. Now say we want to change the... Or have a, have a wallpaper in there, period. So we'll go to Etsy Light DM again. And we'll, um, again... We'll just sudo leafpad light dm dash uh, pantheon gtk reader dot config clnf and it has right here it says default wallpaper equals user usr share backgrounds elementary os dash default all right it's going to leave that the way it is for now and let's go to our um, this is xfce so usr share backgrounds okay and another place to look uh, that I put I think I put a wallpaper is in the uh, pix maps okay there it is there's the wallpaper I had when I first uh, started the video so just uh, again open the terminal here sudo copy arch whatever the name of the wallpaper is you're going to use to slash USR share backgrounds and we'll close this and it looks like it's uh, permissions uh, read only if that's what you want read only for that as long as uh, the reader can read it now the problem is is it's looking for it's a bug I believe is looking for this so what we're going to do is we don't have to ch mod or anything because it's already readable uh again open the terminal in here uh, i believe you can get away with oh no you can at sudo sorry ln dash s arch linux wallpaper dot jp jpeg jpg and i'm just going to copy this name just so there isn't any oops sorry i don't know if i can grab this name So again, I'll copy that, and I'll paste that into the terminal. Okay, and let's go to our background folder, and you see there's a sim link, symbolic link. So all we have to do now is uncomment that, as long as I'm in, yes. We'll save and quit. And we'll quit any other terminals, and I'm not sure if this will work on in VirtualBox, log out or restart, but I'm just going to log out and see. 
there it is. We did have, there's the Arch Linux background, and again, I'm sorry, <laughs> it's not showing you all of the uh, greeter, uh, what it, the theme itself, there's more to it. But that's how you would change the wallpaper, apparently, until maybe one day the bug is fixed, or maybe it has been in uh, on uh, elementary itself, but I'm not sure. So, there you go. So, there's just a different uh, light DM login manager theme, and so on. Okay, so that should do for this one, and thanks so much for watching, and we'll talk to you soon, and bye for now.